strip your gear. Have no fear. Auto expert. Barry Wilson is here. For uh, Barry Wilson from Wilson Auto Repair in Garland. And we won't mention anyone by name that uh, we both know. In your family or mine? Uh, one of each. One of each. Who's actually done this. Right. But and it's easy to do. As in my as family, it wasn't my fault. Whomever my, said that. In my family, it wasn't my fault. That's right. But it happened. And it happened to this, and this is really expensive. It's very expensive. These are the not real new, but fairly new electronic mirrors where you can adjust them from the driver's sure. door so you can see properly. And there's a couple things that people tend to overlook. The, the fact that they bend in and out right. very easily, but a lot of times when you're backing out of the garage, you think that it's going to bend for you when you hit the side of the garage door and it generally crushes this yeah. because it does. It has to have the correct blow on it. So my suggestion is if you don't know that these move, and I've, I've had a lot of people ask me about broken mirrors and, these, and this housing being broken, is just to roll the window down and take it with the hand and bend it in like this if you have a tight situation sure. and not, not hit the mirror on the wall. Yeah, nowadays a lot of garages are just so tight that it probably wouldn't be a... a a dumb thing to do. Mine being one of them. And a lot of times it just crushes the mirror and that mirror cannot be replaced. This unit can run anywhere from 100 to $200. So, so that mirror comes comes off of there or gets cracked or well, something? Well, it gets cracked. Replace? I've had a, this part of it be broken yeah. and, and people will inquire whether or not they can just have the mirror replaced. And that's not, not to my knowledge, there's no one that does that. Wow. So you end up buying the whole thing, which actually bolts up into the door and you have to remove the door panel, and it's very expensive to do this, so the tip today is, is that if you're in a tight situation, stop, roll your window down, and pull it in, right. and get it, get it where it'll clear. Yeah, now not all of them do it, so I mean, right. if, if, if it doesn't rotate, don't try to force it, obviously. That's right, yeah. that's right. Now, the older pickups, you know, they had the metal, sure. and they'd bend in. Most cars, if they're fixed, they're not gonna bend, but the later model cars now generally all have a mirror that'll give. And is that a safety thing, a reason that was put on there? I really don't know. Yeah, yeah, but it, but, but it, it probably will so better safe than sorry that's some good advice a lot of money that I wish we'd known